Yeah, yeah. I actually hate water, but I gotta drink it over here because it's fucking hot. Actually hot. Like, hot. You're just tired, need something liquid. That's not a beer, but want a beer, but got water. Anyway, I'm go inside, chat with Unks. Yeah. Jerry, thought I'd go for a bit of a muck around the Oz, further away from mum, go to the outback, catch up with the Farnucks, catch up with the kangaroos and the snakes. <laughs> oh, gee. The Oe Adventures of Pitipi Kaiwaru, aka Philip, narrated by his mom. Might have a better chance sleeping in the truck. <laughs> I'll, call you, I'll call you back in about a month. Sure. <laughs> Oh, I've missed the seat. This hey. seat's that's just bloody mean, eh? I need one of these back home. Oh, school, but good enough. Oh, boy, so he's got his baby sister's shoes on. Look at it. I remember, I remember growing up, we didn't have a porch, but cab in the bush. Oh, yeah, yeah. Where, where, where about you? Where are you from? Oh, born here, Kalgoorlie. Mm. We're from... Junjunjara, not far from the South Australian border. I grew up in a place, uh, Vanny Creek, which is in Espen. Back in the 70s, it was a bit hard for Aboriginal to get houses. Karoha ki te iwi nei nera, rai patitia tō rātou whenua e tau iwi. So we camped out in a little camp at Vanny Creek. It was just a creek. You dig a hole about that deep and you got fresh water. True. Off the beach. That was our water. Yes. That was pretty hard back then. Nothing much changing. <laughs> no, but our people struggling still. Mm. Pretty hard to see your countrymen camping on the sidewalk mm. in the cold. How many Maori languages do you have? Oh, uh, well, there's like one, but everyone's got their own little, own little twist and everything oh, to it. Oh, yeah. They got their own little ways of saying stuff, but it's all pretty much the same. You can understand them. Oh. They just got their own little <laughs> chance. They'll put like an N at a K or something like that. Weirdos. <laughs> Boys, kupu that he's looking for is dialect. Kei tēnaiwi, kei tēnaiwi, um, tōna ke reo. And what that is so not the same. He did it here. How do you say it up to you in your first, your first language? It's like a... Uh, Nyaba. 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 It means what? What you doing? What's up? What's happening? True. Sort of thing and look at your hands on Nyaba, what you what you doing? It's like a question mark. True. Yeah. I see that now. Yeah, and this is how Pitapi processes things because Kariya boy to tina Kai Terungo boy, Engari Kari Terungo. Maybe got a um blue Tongue lizard at the back there. Oh yeah, we had one the other day. Oh, a couple of weeks ago, he come here. I said, you better look out for that blue tongue lizard. He might bite you. <laughs> what about the spiders? Good any, any big spiders around here? Probably got some red backs in the shed there. Oh. Well, you want to have a look? Oh. What? It's either look at the blue lizard that's scary, or go get a surprise in the shed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, we'll go, we'll go have a look at the redbacks, eh? <laughs> yeah, you I'll talk about chance with the redbacks, even though they're poisonous, but... Blue tongue lizard made me frightened. <laughs> yeah, no, right, yeah, I'll be keen. Yeah. Well, not keen, but... Not bad bush tucker, eh? Well, what, the spiders? No, the uh, blue tongue lizard. Can you eat it? Yeah, well, people eat it for a really long time. Sure. Since the drain time, I think. <laughs> what does it taste like? Oh, it tastes like chicken. I know, boys, fight for cattle once you in there. Is all boys worrying about, can you eat it? Can what can we bread. eat? <laughs> That's what we all say. You all lose a taste like a chicken. You cook it like a steak, like you cut it up into a steak, or you just... Ah, uh, we're cooking it in the, in the ground. Oh, true, true. So like, we'll cover it over there. <laughs> bit of earth and ashes. Oh, like the, um, kangaroo tails. Yeah, like the kangaroo tails. True. We'll go have a look for some red back then. I think I might got a couple in my shed. Red mix? Yeah, well. Yeah. How do you reckon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All good? Yeah. Just trying to find some. Why, yeah? My cousin got bitten by one. He's working in a junkyard down Boulder and 
bitten by a redback spider. I mean, I don't know if these are appropriate stories to tell them while they're in the corporate place. True, so he didn't know it actually, he didn't know it would be bitten. Got bitten. Oh, you know those shoes they are, do they're getting on my goat? Because look, they're small for him because they belong to my princess, not to him. There was a so small too, like a small ass thing. You wouldn't yeah. even be able to see that thing on crawling on you. Don't even think you'll feel it. Can, can you die from that one? Probably can if you don't get it seen too. Better be. Met somebody. Oh yeah, got it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What happened to your foot? Oh, my toes there. One got infected and it went, went dead, going green. Feel different when you got three toes when you left. Gee, you yeah. got three toes. Yeah. Hey, Torunga mea. It's getting the balance back slowly. Mm. Yeah, so far just down the porch. Yeah, I reckon too. Well, two hours later, still here. Maybe it's because I'm scared of the spiders. Hot day, eh? Yeah. Pretty warming up. Hmm. What do um, the young fellas get up to? Uh, they, play, they play a bit of Aussie rules. Mm. Would you like to land some tips? Yeah, yeah. I'm keen. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, what have you? There you go. Oh, it's a black ear. Black ear, Footy player? You're going to give young footy some tips and the yeah, of course. And the skills on the footy, AFL? Yeah. Oh, great, okay, let's go, fellas. You reckon I'll be alright with playing um, in my skulls? Yeah, right, straight up. We always play, yeah. um, usually like local and stuff, we always play for bare foot and all. Oh, true. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's good. Oh, fucking hell, I'm dying out here, son, eh? Most of what I've drunk in my life. It wouldn't be too bad right now. Hurting out here. I flick the thongs off, eh? It's pretty warm for you, fellas, eh? Yeah, lovely and hot. Didn't catch a day like this back home. It's nice and cool. Yeah, though. nice hot day. Oh, no, no, he's got to take the shoes off, but I don't even know if the boy's got a bit of pooking, huh? Any prickles on him? No, no, you'll be all good, no prickles. No prickles. Oh, yeah. We call that a hand pass. Yeah. Hand pass. Yeah, have, have a go at the goal. Hold it straight and straight through the middle post. Right through the middle post. Watch me choke this, Dan Carter. Oh wow! No. <laughs> oh. Wow! Nearly took out the cameraman, Rangi. Jesus. Oh, I might need three days too, so I can kick like the bird. Oh fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Ah, I think I had a click in that one. Oh. You had the right idea. Not here to take part, we're here to take over. Run, 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 finish, run, run, run. Tera momo, tera momo. I'm going for a bit of a water. Eh? Reckon a bit of a water, a bit of a fiver. What mean? These fellas do a lot of running in that game. Yeah. I think I'll just keep being a spectator for now. <laughs> yeah, feeling like I'm a bit of a footy player now. Yeah, I'll be a little bit more practice. I'll be ready to play for one. What's the best thing? Fine. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, me, I'm a I'm Tiger fan, mate. That is our Tahua. Oh, my crow looks neat. Oh, oh well, she's getting late. Time for a bit of shut eye, Maggie. Still never saw that blue tongue lizard. Uncle. Hey, Peter B. You might sleep inside tonight, eh? Bit hot out there. Yeah, bit, bit hot warm today. 